guys, Rick Shaw here. It's the 22nd of uh, September 2021. Uh, I got some uh, news on my channel. Got to be over here again. Uh, they shut it off for two weeks. I did appeal. Uh, I watched the video. It was it was my opinion. I wasn't telling anyone to do anything, but they uh, there's a fellow that's been commenting and uh, turned it in. And it was an old video. It was it was from a while ago. So they they went ahead and shut the channel down. We'll see what happens there. But we'll be we'll be here again two weeks this time. Don't know how long uh, you know if they'll uh, appeal if the appeal goes or not. But it's a yeah, it's a bummer. It's it's just so ridiculous that you can't speak your mind anymore on these places. Uh, as soon as I get the laptop, I'm going to just switch everything over to Odyssey. I know everybody says. Uh, bit shoot but we'll see we'll, we'll see what's going on maybe i'll do them both i'm not sure it's just a real shame that uh you know i can't speak my mind i watched the whole video it's it's still where i can see it uh it says it'll be take taken even off of me for a while i reviewed it uh i never i never told anybody to do anything i said what i'm gonna do and what i think so this is what they call wrong think this is George Orwell wrote about this kind of stuff and uh, it's just to me it's just uh, totally silly you know and then I just saw a, a video on there it was right after mine when I went to click it off this video came up and they showed a guy illegally uh, jumping off a building uh, you know with a with the little parachute thing in his hand and that goes and that's totally illegal uh, then they got another another video that I just saw and uh, I put up on the Facebook with some dude here with underage girls giving them alcohol and uh, they don't have any problem with that they're they're letting that go they're gonna let th this kind of stuff go uh, just because I believe it's it's uh, you know Satan's ruling the roost over there with these with these people and at uh, Facebook you know it's, it just seems that's that's what they want to do now they're making a big fuss with this Zuckerberg that uh, oh you know uh, he put on some kind of uh, slaving thing with the kids so now the, the store won't you know they're gonna pull them out of it and all that ah, baloney that's just all but sounds like a bunch of fake news they're all in this together guys but uh, I did get a friend send me something from Manila now they're starting to say you can't go into the bigger stores they're advertising it I don't know if it's been implemented yet uh, it was in the comments on my last video about how you're gonna have to have this passport uh, they're calling it a passport that's just a sweet name to make it sound nice when basically it's it's you know show me your papers you know that's basically what that is and uh, you know they say history repeats and you know the only thing you ever learn is that you learn new about anything is history <laughs> you know there's nothing new under the sun guys but uh, we had a beautiful day we did a lot of we did a lot of bike riding and and uh did riding the motorcycle kids had a lot of fun we did our we're doing the homeschooling right now with the kids uh they gave us uh books that we're going through uh faye is teaching the tagalog stuff and i'm doing the english stuff uh you know there's there's something that uh you know when it comes to teaching these kids for me it's fun and it's fun for them too because their smiles sometimes uh you know you got you, they have to have fun i remember when i was in school when i was very young there were some teachers that were just nasty you didn't learn nothing you know because they you know they were just dried up old uh prunes it reminds me of uh, uncle buck when he went into the principal's office you know <laughs> And he was talking watch that movie when he's in the principal's office and that that's my feelings exactly it's a shame though uh here on these platforms that you can't speak your mind uh and like i say on the video i wish i could put it up here maybe uh if i can get it i'll put it up on odyssey when i can get that up and running i can't do it on my phone because there's not enough memory that's what it says anyway i don't have enough memory to put it i tried every which way i can't seem to do it even the bit shoot ones I couldn't do. Don't know why. I don't. I don't know why that's not going on now. Because I did put a video or two on there before. I wish I'd have kept doing it. Every video. I wish I'd have kept doing it. Then you could have watched it. Uh, like I say, I never said to anyone what to do. I said what I'm going to do. 
and what I think about it, what I think about all this stuff's going on. There's a there's a lot of stuff going on in this world right now that, uh, you know, like I said in that video, it's got my spidey senses up. You know, something something to think about, and uh, you know, this stuff. Uh, and it was about mandates. From what I understand, a mandate's not a law. You know, and. Uh, you know, you just got, you have to use do your due diligence, as I've heard people say, and and look into all the stuff yourself. And like I said in that video, if you want to if you want to if you wanna do something uh, medically for your own, it's it's up to you. Uh, I personally don't think that uh, somebody should be able to tell you how to do that. You can get advice from your doctors or from anybody, but uh, I myself anymore with a lot of doctors, uh, they just push stuff. You know, they ju they'll just push things. And, uh, you know, I, I had a doctor here, he was pushing uh, cholesterol medicine and all this. And I'm like, nah, I don't want that. And he got mad. He got, he got mad uh, because, you know, he wasn't going to get a cut, I guess. But I had a doctor in the States that he's dead set against that stuff. He said, it's, you know, turn, you know it's not, I, I don't want you to have it. That's basically what he told me. So, uh, you know, because I, I questioned him on it. I said, yeah, what's, all, what's about all this, uh, like, Liptor and these statins? And every, oh, no, you don't, you know, be careful of that. So he's a, he's a true doctor. He's one of these guys that still uh, does house calls. It's in a little country town. He he does house calls. Last time I saw him, uh, he's getting up there now. <laughs> you know, he thinned out a good bit. Good guy, Indian guy, and uh, you know I I put my trust in him many years ago, and I still trust him because he ain't pushing stuff on you. He's not pushing it at all. It's the same with the uh, FLU. Uh, uh, Jabba the Huts that they that a lot of doctors want you to get all the time. He's like, what for? You, what you got the flu? You are you prone to the flu? Eat good, you know. Eat vegetables. Eat, eat fruit. You know that's basically what he says. That's his. That's the type of doc he is. And uh, you know that's more the old style. I wish there was more like him, uh, but. Who knows? But I'm going to go ahead and just sign off. This is just starting up again. Uh, tell, tell all your buddies um, I'm here again. I don't know how else to post that. So, uh, and let people know. Uh, it'd be nice if they gave you a warning. <laughs> You know that this was going to happen but boom it's just shut down it's still there i can't post anything i can't uh, reply to comments i can't do anything to it i'm basically locked out right now so that is a royal bummer but this is still me and you all take care of yourself now you yeah? have